Boban is roaming free in the paint right now. Y'all call him Boban Marjanovic. I call him, you rang, you rang, <laughs> run the floor, you rang. Oh, yes, you Great rang, thing. can play. Hi, <laughs> Joking, let's go. Come in, guys. <laughs> Boban, before Thank we let you, you go, I gotta hear it. You rang. <laughs> <laughs> you rang. Yeah! How Shaq say you rang. I heard that a couple times how he say, and that time, please, please, can you say, can you say that? You rang. I was like, you rang. <laughs> I really enjoy. The guy missed the lurch. I, I can be that right person for that, the, for Adam's family. Guys, call Boban. <laughs> When someone says, Bean Boban, what does that mean to you? Big friendly giant. <laughs> they say I talk too much on the bench. Hey! Hey! Through 75 years. Opa! These guys in the fire! And over 4,500 players. <laughs> it's uh, Boban size and uh, my wife size. <laughs> It's possible the NBA has never seen anyone quite like seven foot four Boban Marjanovic. He is as beloved as any player in the NBA by his teammates. You don't meet these people every day, you know, he's amazing. He will help you anytime, and you know, it's just great to have him here. He might be the nicest guy I ever met, man. I give you that, baby. You're my guy. My guy. You ask anybody about Boban, it's like, man, he's the greatest dude you know. And it's the truth because every day he never has a, a bad day. You know, he has appreciation for where he's at, where he first started. Boban prosto zrači pozitivnom energijom i ta njegova energija privlači ljude oko njega. I on uvek ima vremena za svakog i ljudi to vole, ljudi to cene i poštuju to kod njega. I come from a small town, 3,000 people. We have mountain, they call it Rtanj. This is the place on earth when they give you good energy. Everybody have bad days. In that like bad day, you beat with the positive energy, with a smile. I feel amazing, you know, first time on TV. Hi, man, hi, dad, hi, family. Boban was born in Eastern Serbia in 1988 and grew up surrounded by a brutal civil war that enveloped the entire region. NATO attacks have begun uh, against Serbian forces. I was super young at that time. We don't expect tomorrow, we don't expect tomorrow. Like, this is like the scary part of the, we everybody sleeps, slept in the same room, like me, my mom, and uh, sister and me, because we want to be together. In case something happened, we want, like, you want to be together. When you hear that sound of the planes come through your city, you scare, you try to find, like, uh, where you can cover, where you can go, you cannot be on the street, and that type of stuff. I hope so, I never feel that in my life anymore. Boban says he fell in love with basketball at age 10, but didn't discover his real strength on the court until a few years later. Were you able to dunk, like, the first time you were out there? I never tried to dunk in my life, because I never believe I'm tall. My coach tell me, hey, you're supposed to dunk every ball. I was like, how? And he said, go to dunk one, one time, and I dunk. He was like, wow, this is super easy. Now I go to dunk with two hands. I was like, no, no, no way I can dunk with two hands. And I dunk with two hands, first time in my life, I was like, wow, this is, feels so amazing. After that, I start to dunk everything. Boban turned professional at 17, joining the Serbian club, Hemofarm. When we first started watching Boban around 2007 and then 2008 and 9, he was a project. I think the thing that impressed me was thinking, well, he's not going to be an NBA player, but he's definitely going to have a good European career. Boban played throughout Europe for a few years before returning to Serbia in 2012, where he was named league MVP for three straight seasons. Marjanovic, an opposing figure. Marjanovic, was too easy for him. Marjanovic, he's the man. He improved. And that led to getting an opportunity to play for the famed Red Star in Belgrade in the Euro League in 2013. Broke some records, some history, the most rebounds, the most uh, double doubles. I play amazing. 
his last two years in Europe, he was basically the MVP of every game, so <laughs> definitely enjoyable two seasons. He became a Serbian Shaq in the EuroLeague. The light came on for NBA teams that this kid would have a chance to play in the NBA. In 2015, Boban got a text message he says he'll never forget. Greg Popovich and the San Antonio Spurs wanted to bring him to the NBA. I was like, wow, I cannot believe I read that message. This is like my dream. You know, you want to play in the NBA. You want to be like part of the best league on the world. Don't mess with the Boban. Boban is an energizer. My great game when we play against Minnesota, and we're losing a little bit, and I know I scored maybe 17 points. I feel how it feels so good. I feel amazing. Fans, how they give me that energy. Boban Marjanovic has the place jumping. It's one of my first games that I really play super good. After the Spurs, Boban played for three teams in three seasons before signing with the Mavericks in 2019. Boban has always struggled to find minutes in the NBA. Smoljanovic throws it down. What a performance. Despite that, he currently has the 11th highest player efficiency rating in league history. I think the main reason he doesn't play as much as maybe the analytics say he should is because there are still times in the modern NBA game, big men have become dinosaurs, where he can be left at the side of the road. If a team goes small against him and you have five three-point shooters, they're going to make threes and he's going to make twos. It's just that simple. Many of us who've watched the NBA for a long time feel like if Boban had come along in the 80s and 90s, that he actually could be a star. I heard that so many times, but you know, like I live in this world and of course, maybe like that, like 15 years ago, it's been much easier for me, but still you need to find your own way in this world. Marjanovic, that's too easy. 31 points, Boban Marjanovic. Boban has been in America for six years now and he's very much at home. I love soup so much. This is like culture, culture in my country. For breakfast, not allowed, but for lunch and dinner, I try to eat soup and I really love it. We can go to like a Popeye's or whoever. He's always gonna ask, do you have soup? No matter where it is, he's just always gonna ask, do you have soup? Even though statistically he's not an iconic player, there's no doubt that Boban's a star. He's a fan favorite. His videos go viral constantly. And he's even in commercials with his best friend, Tobias Harris. What is that? It's Boban back. Give me some. No. You get Toby back. Oh, we're going to need Boban again. Where's Boban? I want to speak with everybody, and I am man of the people. Big friendly giant. You know, in the movies, I want to be like bad guy. No, like in personal life, I'm a good guy. Boban got that chance to be a villain when he was murdered by Keanu Reeves in the third John Wick movie. I get a text message from my, uh, from my agency. Uh, they was like, hey, they want you to be in a John Wick movie. I was like, John Wick? So I'll write like seven times, yes, 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 yes. Consider your origins. You were not made to live as brutes, but to follow virtue and knowledge. Dante. The filming experience is so fun, you know, like standing there and practice scene with Keanu Reeves, I was like, are you serious, this Keanu? You sure this is what you want to do? 14 million, it's a lot of money. Not if you can't spend it. I was so happy because they have opportunity to work in one of my favorite movies. I'm still alive, by the way. <laughs> so what is Boban then? A basketball player? Get it, Bobby. Bobby. Three pointer! A movie star? An entertainer whose personality could energize a team and light up its arena? Why can't it be all of them? In your face, Luca! To have somebody who just sees the joy in life is invaluable. It's like having a cute dog in the locker room. Not, not that Bobby's a puppy or anything, but he's just got that, that joy to him that, that just comes out of him. It's contagious. Never be shy to be who you are. If you're tall, you're tall. You need to carry that on the best way you can to become some person who you want to be. 
make people smile around yourself and don't worry what other people think about you and never give up in your dreams. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.